Hello everyone, welcome to Math Corner. In this video, we will solve quadratic equations by extracting the root. A quadratic equation of the form x squared is equal to c, where c is constant term, can be solved by extracting the root of both sides of the equation. By extracting a square root of x squared is equal to c, we have square root of x squared is equal to positive negative square root of c. Square root of x squared is equal to x, so we have x is equal to positive negative square root of c. Let us separate the two values. x sub 1 is equal to positive square root of c, and x sub 2 is equal to negative square root of c. Example number 1, let us solve x squared is equal to 16. Step number 1, express the equation in the form x squared is equal to c. Since this equation is already expressed in the form x squared is equal to c, let us proceed to the next step. Step number 2, extract the root of both sides of the equation. Square root of x squared is equal to positive negative square root of 16. Square root of x squared is equal to x. Positive negative square root of 16 is equal to positive negative 4. Let us separate the two values. x sub 1 is equal to positive 4 and x sub 2 is equal to negative 4. Example number 2. Let us solve x squared minus 9 is equal to 0. Step number 1, let us express the equation in the form x squared is equal to c by adding positive 9 to both sides of the equation. x squared minus 9 plus 9 is equal to x squared and 0 plus 9 is equal to 9. Step number 2, extract the root of both sides of the equation. We have square root of x squared equals positive negative square root of 9. Square root of x squared is equal to x. And since 9 is perfect square, square root of 9 is equal to positive negative 3. Let us separate the two values. x sub 1 is equal to positive 3 and x sub 2 is equal to negative 3. Example number 3, let us solve x squared minus 12 is equal to 0. Step number 1, express the equation in the form x squared is equal to c. Let us add positive 12 to both sides of the equation. x squared minus 12 plus 12 is equal to x squared and 0 plus 12 is equal to 12. Step number 2, extract the root of both sides of the equation. Square root of x squared is equal to positive negative square root of 12. Square root of x squared is equal to x. 12 is not perfect square, but we can simplify positive negative square root of 12. It is also equal to positive negative square root of 4 times 3. x is equal to positive negative square root of 4 times square root of 3. Since positive negative square root of 4 is equal to positive negative 2, x is equal to positive negative 2 square root of 3. Let us separate the two values. x sub 1 is equal to positive 2 square root of 3 and x sub 2 is equal to negative 2 square root of 3. Example number 4, let us solve x squared plus 10 is equal to 4. Step number 1. Express the equation in the form x squared is equal to c. Let us add negative 10 to both sides of the equation. x squared plus 10 plus negative 10 is equal to x squared and 4 plus negative 10 is equal to negative 6. Step number 2, extract the root of both sides of the equation. We have square root of x squared is equal to positive negative square root of negative 6. Square root of x squared is equal to x. Positive negative square root of negative 6 is also equal to positive negative square root of negative 1 times 6. 
x is equal to positive negative square root of negative 1 times square root of 6. Since square root of negative 1 is equal to i, or imaginary number, we have x is equal to positive negative i square root of 6. Let us separate the two values. x sub 1 is equal to positive i square root of 6. x sub 2 is equal to negative i square root of 6. Last example, example number 5. Let us solve square of x minus 4 minus 25 is equal to 0. Step number 1, express the equation in the form x squared is equal to c. Let us add positive 25 to both sides of the equation. Since negative 25 plus 25 is equal to 0, we have square of x minus 4 on the left side. On the right side, 0 plus 25 is equal to 25. Step number 2, extract the root of both sides of the equation. Square root of square of x minus 4 is equal to positive negative square root of 25. Square root of square of x minus 4 is equal to x minus 4. And since 25 is perfect square, square root of 25 is equal to positive negative 5. Let us solve for x by adding positive 4 to both sides of the equation x minus 4 plus 4 is equal to x. On the right side, we have 4 plus minus positive 5. Let us separate the two values. x sub 1, we have 4 plus 5. 4 plus 5 is equal to 9. x sub 2, we have 4 minus 5. 4 minus 5 is equal to negative 1. And the values of x are positive 9 and negative 1. And that is how to solve quadratic equations by extracting square roots or extracting the root. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching.